Okay, so it's November 6th, and I feel like in my previous video when I tried explaining CRDP and Gillian Bray, I didn't do a fantastic job at explaining how it affects your body and like the mechanisms of your immune response. So I want you guys to know it's an autoimmune disorder, which means that your body attacks itself. So for my disease, it affects your nerves, your peripheral nervous system, and causes paralysis. So it's sort of like you have your nerves and you have the myelin sheath wrapped around your nerve. And in the myelin sheath cells, there are molecules and normally antibodies think that they're you know they're normal guys just doing their normal job of being myelin sheath and slating the nerve but in an autoimmune case the antibodies detect a molecule that looks like a foreign body um, like bacteria or a virus and it decides that it wants to attack it it's a second line inflammatory immune response. So like these antibodies, they, you know, grab pitchforks and torches and they go at that, that terrorist and they're like, they want to get you out of there. So your, uh, your, all your, your myelin sheath, um, becomes inflamed or sometimes like it just, um, really like erodes the, the myelin. So it affects the nerve signal conduction. And, um, yeah, so for the treatment for that, um, in my case, is that that works for me is corticosteroids. Um, steroids worked for me the first time 10 years ago when I had this disease also. So the steroids come in like a police officer telling like these antibodies who are like ravenous drunk people, you know, attacking this foreign body that they, they think it's a foreign body, but really it's just a it's just a messenger guy just trying to get the signal across, you know, he's one of them. So the steroid acts like a policeman and he, he arrests these antibodies who are acting up, who are all drunk, so he, he arrests them to stop that stops the in, um the inflammatory response. So thank God for steroids. I'm gonna be pumping iron, getting buff, getting a moon face, all because of steroids, but I would rather have moon face any day than be paralyzed for months and months on end. So, yeah, I think that that's a little bit better explanation. I mean, the link that I put in my previous video of the doctor um, explaining that in his PowerPoint is obviously way better because he's a doctor but um you guys should check that out if you're interested in learning a little bit more about how your immune system can do crazy things and so and I also wanted you guys to know about this disease first of all it's like one in a hundred thousand gets CIDP I'm lucky and I think it's if I'm, my research is correct it's only about five percent or so of these patients that have CIDP relapse. That's me. Again, uh, really, uh, really lucky. Should play the lottery. Um, but yeah, so I want you guys to know that and what else about CIDP? Oh, to be continued.